So is the U.S. public getting a fair, balanced, and accurate perspective about Israel through the old media and new media? That's a tough question. You know, it's not, you can say Afghanistan or anything and not Israel and ask yourself whether people get the fair question. It depends on what you consider as a fair question. I think that Israel is tremendously successful, and this is my response to David, in presenting its own version of the story. And while reporters will doubt some things Israelis says or do, they will usually frame the story from the Israeli perspective. And in the States, in Europe, Israel is less successful. Israel is very successful I think, first of all, because Israel is able to maintain a situation which I think is unmaintainable, which is keeping two point something million of people without rights, people older than my age, without basic civil rights, you know, the right to travel, the right to work, uh, wherever they want, freedom of, complete freedom of speech, you know, keeping a population which is like 50% of your own population under these conditions for 40 years and doing it, you know, without getting too much of a hassle from the states is pretty successful, I would say. I don't think, you know, David comes from uh, marketing and I think Israel has excellent marketing. If, you, if I would go to if, if this was a, a marketing meeting, I would say to the company, which is Israel, you, you get a problem with the product. You market very well, but your product is deteriorating. And what are, would you elaborate on a few of the things where you think the product's deteriorating? The occupation is getting worse, and civil rights within, Israel's, within Israel are getting worse. Now, we gotta separate things. David is right. I live pretty comfortable life in Tel Aviv. And coming to Tel Aviv, you know, I prefer Tel Aviv to New York, no offense, but <laughs> coming to Tel Aviv and sitting on the beach and I'm going to see a film and, and you might think you're in one of the nicest Mediterranean cities and I guess you, you pretty much are, but, but 20 minutes from my house, driving, you know, the distance between Staten Island and the Bronx there are villages like Bil'in and Alin, whose land was confiscated by Israel security, Israel security barrier, and people there can't go to their own fields, and they were actually thrown to prison for protesting against that. And when I go to sympathize with them, I'm violating Israeli laws as well. <coughs> so maintaining an image where everything is about security and nothing is about human rights and successfully having this story, you know, here, and, and, and promoting this story here, I think is a very big success. And I, I would have one more point. You know, Israel has a propaganda office. It's the only Western democracy that has one, to the best of my knowledge. There is the foreign office, and now there is a minister, Yuli Edelstein, who's in charge of propaganda. In Hebrew, we call it hasbara, which, which means explaining, because we think that if we explain our case better, people will leave us alone. But I think supporters of Israel should ask themselves why their country needs someone to constantly explain its position. And why does it have to hire such skillful people uh, uh, to do it. And this is the problem we are facing. And this is something that really bothers me as an Israeli. And I think it should bother people who care about, uh, care about Israel as well. Talking about the product, I think we have a good product. And at the end of the day, you know, the product is not a product over there in such a remote country. The product at the end of the day is you, me, Tel Aviv, the country we know, the country we live. Yes, we still have challenges. I mean, the product we have is not perfect, um, but I 
think the product is a good one. Having said that, I wish the way you describe the things were, was true, because I don't see how Israel is having a success by marketing its, uh, its policy. And maybe if we have success, and we have success in, in, in certain aspects, maybe it's because the American public opinion perceives the things the same way we perceive it. Maybe because we are sharing sometimes the same, uh, uh, the same values. Maybe because they also saw what were, what were Israel efforts in order to achieve peace. And unfortunately, we were, we were uh, responded or we got uh, uh, the, the, the reaction that we got from the other side. Having said that, I'm also in favor of human rights. I'm also in favor of peace. I'm also in favor of a, a, the Palestinians' right to, to determine themselves. I also want to see the Palestinians living in peace and in their own country. There is no doubt about it. And, and if you look at the, a, a, at the spectrum of the, Israeli, of the Israeli politics, you will see that right and left, or most le right, most parties on the right are in favor of a Palestinian state. The only question is under which conditions. And a, a, but I believe that we, the product we have is a good product. I, as a marketing person, I don't believe that marketing can market a product if the product is not good. I don't believe that the American public opinion is stupid to, a, to buy all the ideas we are selling them if the product weren't good enough. So, the reason the American public opinion is accepting a part, because I don't think they're accepting all the Israeli policy, I wish it was like that, but they don't. Uh, but the reason the public opinion is accepting Israel's policy is maybe because they reached a conclusion that Israel is, is, is the good guy in this, uh, in, in this uh, uh, scenario. But having said that, I think I'll, 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 I'll be wrong if I said that we haven't uh, committed a, a, or we haven't done uh, mistakes. Absolutely, we, we have done mistakes. And, and part of being a democracy, part of, the, of this a, a, a motion of being a democracy is, is by saying that yes, we did mistakes. And just to sum up, I believe that the product is a good product. A, I'm sure the product is a good product. And I'm sure, or I want to believe that we will continue looking at the situation with a very, a, 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 with a very, a, 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 let's say, with a, in a way that we're going to to criticize ourselves, but we'll go on uh, improving uh, the product that we're having. Would you like to